welcome to Stardust Gold Crochet. This is Tasha. Today's tutorial is going to be on the half double crochet three together. And I've done a little swatch here where you can see what those look like. Um, when you're working on a regular single crochet row like this, it will actually make a decrease happen. For here, I did a little fillet pattern kind of so that you could see what the stitches look like and also you can use it in a pattern without um, using it just for the purpose of a decrease. So I've already gone ahead and I've chained two at the beginning and we're going to work back through the stitches starting with the first stitch which is the third chain from the hook. So the beginning step, the first step is to yarn over, insert your hook into your first stitch, grab your yarn and pull up a loop. So there we have three loops on our hook and if we were to complete the half double crochet we would yarn over and pull through all three but we're going to do a decrease. So we're going to insert our yarn over, insert our hook into the next stitch, grab your yarn and pull up another loop. Then you repeat that one more time for a total of three times and then yarn over and pull through all your loops. And if you're working just a decrease, you would continue working along. You can chain two if you want your stitches to be even. For this tutorial, I'll chain two. We're not going to skip anything though. So we're going to yarn over, insert your hook, yarn over and pull up a loop, yarn over, insert your hook, yarn over and pull one up, yarn over, insert your hook, yarn over and pull up another one. So you have a total of two, four, six, seven, seven loops on your hook. Then yarn over and pull through all of those. And that creates a half double crochet three together. And you're decreasing by two. So you started with three stitches and you only have one stitch. Let's do it one more time, and this time I'm not going to chain between the two of them. Insert your hook in the first stitch, grab and pull up a loop, yarn over, insert your hook in the next stitch, pull up a loop, yarn over, insert your hook in the next stitch, pull up a loop, and then yarn over and pull through all of your loops. And you can see if you were to continue this way without chaining, you would be decreasing by two each time. If you chain two in between, you can get a little fillet, fillet like this, and you're not going to be decreasing by anything because you're chaining two. So, all right, I hope that helps you guys, and I hope you learned something new. Uh, leave a comment below if you have any questions, and also, if you would like me to create a video for you, I'm happy to do that. Just leave a comment below, tell me what stitch you want to learn, and I'll try to, to do my best to make a video for you. And this this is Lion Brand, Brian, Lion Brand's yarn, Heartland. And I'll leave a link for this yarn in the comments or in my description box below. Thanks, guys. Happy crocheting.